control. Chaos. Darkness. Dear Detective Hodges, Sir, I write for many reasons, but must begin by congratulating you on your years of service. 27 as a detective and 40 in all. I saw some of the retirement ceremony on TV, Public Access Channel 2, a resource overlooked by many, and happened to know that there was a party at the Rain Tree Inn out by the airport the following night. In one article about your retirement, your longtime partner described you as a combination of by the book and intuitively brilliant. If it is true, and I think it is, you will have figured out by now that I am one of those few you did not catch. I am sure you gave it your best shot. And I imagine if there ever was a perk you wanted to catch, it was the Mercedes killer. Eight dead. So many more wounded. I must say, I exceeded even my own wildest expectations. I have to tell you how much fun it was. I still relive the thuds and the crunchy noises, and the way the car bounced on its springs when it went over the bodies. For power and control, give me a Mercedes 12-cylinder every time. So you are probably thinking, what kind of sick and twisted SOB do we have here? Most people are fitted with a conscience. I have none. So I can soar high above the heads of the normal crowd. If I'd been caught, I would have been arrested and gone to trial, where I probably would have pleaded insanity. Maybe I even am insane. The idea has certainly crossed my mind. But it is a peculiar kind of insanity. Anyway, I got away. The fog helped. I have absolutely no urge to do it again. I have my memories and they are as clear as a bell. So you see, we are both retired. I do have one concern. I looked it up on the internet and discovered retired police have an extremely high suicide rate. I think of you all alone in your house on Humper Road, Detective Hodges, and I worry. Are you watching a lot of TV? Are you drinking more? Do the hours go by more slowly because your life is now so empty? I fear that might be the case. I wouldn't want you to start thinking about your gun. But you are thinking of it, aren't you? Just kidding. Very truly yours, the Mercedes Killer. P.S. Want to get in touch with me? Try Under Debbie's Blue Umbrella. I even got you a password, KermitFrog19. I might not reply, but hey, you never know. P.P.S. Hope this letter has cheered you up.